So we're continuing on our Fitness Challenge app for the demo app. Uh, in the previous one, we uh, created our variables and our functions. In this one, we're going to start with the user input. And I think the easiest place to start is probably with the clear data, meaning uh, we're going to get rid of everything that the users put in. Now, the first thing that we want to do is we cr created that data invisible function. So we're going to make the data invisible once we've uh, done this. Uh, and the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to come to our data list view and we're going to clear out those elements. So data list view elements and we're going to create that into an empty list. And I have one of those blocks I can duplicate over here. Uh, the total number label um, as well, I can see here, I can just duplicate from here. Our total number label, and we can get rid of that false. Uh, our text for that, we're going to set equal to zero because we're again we're going to display that as zero. Uh, we're going to do the average number label, duplicate from up here as well. Again, the text of that we're going to set to zero on this, and. Then we're going to start clearing our variables. So we can just start here. I'm going to grab this because we already have an empty list. And I'm going to duplicate it three times. And what I'm going to clear is my entry activities, my entry days, and these are all things the user and my activity minutes are going to input. Now, my uh, next thing I need to do is take the uh, global name. So we're going to set my global name variable. And my global age variable, and we're going to set those to a blank tech box as well. We're just going to duplicate here get rid of those spaces in there and duplicate here. So we've cleared out those and now we need to take those labels and also we need to display that we've cleared them out. So I'm going to come to my name text box uh, and I can't grab from here, so I wasn't able to duplicate it. So I'm going to actually have to come over here to my text box. Uh, where my name text box? Oh, grab one of these. And I'm going to grab my age text box and grab one of these. And both of these I'm going to change to my uh, text. And again, I'm going to say, set those to being blank now. So what we've done is we basically cleared all our information for our user. Now, when we hit the submit button, because that's another easy one we can do, we're basically saying that we're going to uh, change that those global variables we have here for our age and our name. And we're going to display uh, what's in those text boxes. So I'm going to come here and go my text box text for the name. And I'm going to duplicate down. And I can change this one to the age. So we've set up our clear and our submit button. The next thing that we can go ahead along and do is go to our show data when that is clicked. The show data is really simple. All those procedures that we've ran, so all those procedures of the, uh, so that we can start off with our data uh, visible, it should be visible, shown. We're going to display our sum. We're going to display our average. And we're going to display our data list which is display data list. So now we're all set up. The only thing we have left to do 